very simplistic, but I think if there's one theme that companies should keep in mind, it's this idea of customer centricity. It sounds like a sort of throwaway comment, and many companies think they're acting this way. They're really not. Um, if you look at any org chart, you know, the customer is completely ignored. If you look at how companies talk about themselves in annual reports, the customer is, is ignored. If you look at all the data uh, that's measured, it, it's always very internal. We need a complete sort of shift in how companies think. It's not about getting better at what you've always made. It's about making better things. Whether it's customer experiences, whether it's customer service, it's using the power of new technology and more imagination and more empathy to really serve people in a better way. The really hard thing with innovation is to create a business case for something that's never been done. Generally speaking, companies are amazing at repeating the same thing over and over again. I think of sort of infrastructure as a good analogy. Like if you have a sort of railway system that appears to work, it's extremely difficult to create a business case to build a brand new railway system because it continues to work. And that it's not that good and it gets worse every year and that people go on strike and that the material is degrading. Capital expenditure for something which is bold and dramatic is almost impossible to get signed off in companies. And the business case for the cost of not doing something is never accounted for either. So the real economic problem with innovation is really trying to make a case for something that you know in your heart is a good idea. But knowing that the payback period may take quite a long time Time, and knowing that people need to sort of put their reputations on the line somewhat as part of that process. Ultimately, the change that technology brings really comes down to how deeply it's integrated. And often it's really boring technology that makes quite a big difference. Um, it could be something like the API, it could be something like collaborative software. Even the mobile phone sort of feels quite dull that we haven't really made the most of that. So I think more than anything else in this world where everyone's got a quick take, people need to take a bit of a step back and think how can this technology allow us to do our jobs in different ways? What parts of our jobs can be automated? What parts of our jobs don't need to be done anymore? what can we do with this to make us all have a better life? And I worry generally that we're using it to do extra. So it's now, how can even more people try to market to you? How can we create even more content? I think instead we should be thinking less of more and more of better. So how can we make advertising that's better? How can we do customer service that's not cheaper, that's better? How can we use this data to make better decisions? And I think it's gonna take us a bit of time to really understand the meaning and the sort of implications and the limitations of some of this software.